Hi, are you interested in creating more intimacy in your life? Are you looking to open up your heart and have those connections with other people you've always wanted? Or are you looking to finally have those deep connections you've been craving your whole life? Wherever you're at, whatever you're working on, I'd like to invite you to listen in just for a few minutes as I explain to you how to develop true intimacy with anyone. Intimacy does not take years of getting to know somebody. Intimacy is something that you can experience in a moment if you've done the work. Intimacy is a result of you making someone else feel safe enough to truly be themselves, just like you want to feel safe enough to truly be yourself with someone else. If you don't feel safe, then you never let them in. And if you want to have someone else let you in, you've got to make them feel safe. Obviously that translates into making love. There's no question that the level of experience that you're going to have when you're making love to your partner is going to be very different if you feel totally safe with them than if you don't, if you feel totally connected with them. Can you imagine a relationship where it's okay for you to tell your partner, lover, anything and everything that you think and feel? That you don't have to hide anything at all from them because you know that no matter what you're going through, no matter what you're thinking, that they're on your side, that they support you and that they don't judge and criticize you. That's what you deserve to have in your life. And you might be afraid just with me saying that at the thought of, oh my God, I can't share with anybody my deepest thoughts and feelings. Well, that's a very lonely way to live life. Do you wanna be lonely your whole life? Maybe you've already got some very close intimate connections with people where you feel that you can tell them everything, but maybe you don't have it with everyone or you don't have it with the people you want the most, like your kids or your parents or maybe your spouse. There is a way to break free of the fear that you might have and there is a way to remove the walls that you have that can allow you to truly connect and to be intimate and to be open with those that you love and have them be open and intimate with you and let you in and have that really deep relationship that you've always known you could have, but maybe you just didn't know how. The way that you do it is you go through every little part of you that's in judgment of them and of yourself. You've got to release, erase, get rid of all of your judgment. I know what you're thinking. Well, I've tried that. I've been working on that and it's never worked for me. Well, that's because you, in the past, maybe didn't use a tool that is permanent. Almost every tool out there in the world that claims to be the best tool ever is not permanent or doesn't work on your unconscious mind. Installing positive thoughts and programs into the unconscious mind does not remove your judgment. It only puts positive thoughts in. Judgment needs to be taken out. The seven steps to reprogramming yourself is the only process that exists in the world today that will show you step by step in seven steps how to remove things from your unconscious mind that you don't want to be there, including your judgment. If you already know the seven steps, which I hope you do, then what you want to do is focus on releasing the layers and layers and layers of judgment you have about other people, about yourself, and everything that other people do. The best thing to do is start with someone that's very close to you. If you're in a relationship, start with them. Erase every bit of judgment you have about them. And that's not the only thing you need to do. You don't need to just erase all of your judgment. You also then need to have a conversation to reestablish the relationship from a new point of view. Because now you've created a new context where you are working towards being completely non-judgmental, which really means being totally unconditionally loving. If you can create unconditional love with your partner, they can then let you in fully and vice versa. It starts with you. If you're working towards that and you're clearing all your layers of judgment and becoming unconditionally loving, you ought to tell them what you're working on and ask for their help. And that will open them up to looking at you new and fresh because you are new and fresh when you erase some old stuff. You become the real you. You become the kind, authentic, true self that you've always known was in there that just was dying to come out. And as that you emerges from underneath the layers of crap and judgment that used to be there, that feeling of safety will be automatic for your sweetheart. And intimacy will happen effortlessly.
That's how you make it happen. Now this weekend, we're doing a course called A Course in Relationships. And I'll be talking much more about intimacy, but not only about that. We'll be talking about all the different aspects of relationships. And most importantly, the one rule, the one and only rule of relationships that you must know if you wish to have an amazing relationship with anyone. We'll talk about parenting and pets and how to manifest your ideal partner, how to be in love your whole life, how to deal with sexual assault and grief from the death of a loved one, how to drop all of your baggage from all of your previous relationships, and truly how to be incredible in your love life, in your relationships with your family, with your friends, and so on. A Course in Relationships is two days long. It's Saturday and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. It's this Saturday and Sunday, March 24th and 25th in Irvine, California. That's in the United States. If you cannot make it this Saturday and Sunday, then sign up for the course and you'll have access to the online training as soon as the video of the course is out of editing. It might be a while because editing does take some time, but if you sign up now, you'll lock in the discounted price. Whereas if you wait until after we release it, it might be a lot more expensive. So this is your chance to jump in and grab it. If you can only come for a Saturday or only come for a Sunday, that's fine. Just keep in mind that you must have the seven steps to reprogramming yourself under your belt. You have to have taken that course. It's not too late to take it online and then come this Saturday and Sunday. You absolutely can do that if you've never taken the seven steps. You can definitely jump in and enjoy this life-altering training. It's going to be incredible and I can't wait for you to attend. Now the pricing is going to be very low as a test to see if we can get everyone watching the video, like you, to come and join in this weekend. We do have a little bit of space left. Maybe we could fit a few more people and we wanna give you the chance to jump in. Uh, the price after the test will be well, it's unknown, but it'll most likely will be a lot higher. So you want to take advantage of it while you have the chance. I'm trying to think if there's any questions you might have about the training. And I, I think ultimately the question is, do you want to have the most amazing relationships possible for the rest of your life beginning this weekend? And if that's the case, then I'll see you this Saturday and Sunday, or I'll see you through the online training. My name is Arno Goran. It's been a pleasure. I'll talk with you soon. The results and benefits of our training program are only available to members of our private association.